Ah, how's everybody? Today, in this video, we, and when I say we, I mean you, are going to uh, crush your hybrids. Let's go. So we know the hybrid is a valuable tool in the game of golf. A lot of people struggle with it. Even Dustin Johnson didn't have a hybrid in his bag until just recently. So uh, there's some good things and bad things. And for, even for me, I used to hook these things like you would not believe. So today I'm gonna give you my top tips for how to, be, uh, how to pure your hybrids more often than not. Right down the middle, that was a good one. Uh, as always, thanks for tuning in. Be sure to hit that like button. And if you wanna stay up to date with the latest tips, drills, product reviews, be sure to hit the subscribe button and the bell notification so you don't miss anything. Okay, tip, tip one here uh, with our hybrids is going to take place, well, tip one here uh, with our hybrids is gonna take place on the tee box. Well, all our tips are gonna be applied everywhere we go, whether you're on the tee box, fairway, whatever. We're just gonna move through the course and uh, in each scenario, I'll give you the tip that, um, that applies. So here, what we wanna do is we wanna make sure that we are not thinking hit down on the golf ball. Hitting down on the golf ball, really with all your shots is going to cause major problems. And especially with the hybrids, once you start coming down on it, you start shutting that face and you hit these big old duck hooks to the left. So we don't want that at all. I want to think shallow swing and shallow just means I'm here I'm not pulling my hands down I'm just letting them fall and letting my right hand let's say fall down like this on my swing and coming more around my body so you just want to think shallow golf swing here here no divot just a brushing brush the ground with the bottom of the club that's the thought process. If you do it correctly, your tee should survive. It might break, that's fine too, but no big divots. We don't would ever want to divot with this thing, here or the fairway, ever. So just think shallow. Let's move on. Okay, this next tip uh, applies obviously here and everywhere else, but it's going to be ball position, okay? So where do we want the ball positioned in our stance? Let me show you here. This is a great way to do it. Okay, you just put your feet together. Put the ball in the center. Take here, take just a kind of a little step and then a medium step and it should be in the perfect position. I really want it off my just left eye. So it's, it's just slightly forward a touch, okay? Uh, don't get in a bad habit of putting it back because that causes you to start hitting down on the ball, which we you know, talked about before. So we wanna make sure that our ball position is just slightly, slightly, maybe a ball in front of center, okay? That's gonna really help. And that's just really gonna help you be able to sync things up and get the club moving in the correct you know, places so that you don't hit down and you're hitting on the upswing and uh, everything's nice and easy. It's a longer club, we've gotta give it a little more time, not as much as a driver, but just really be focused on your ball position. That's really gonna be key when you're trying to get consistency with your hybrids. Let's go. Okay, this next tip is uh, really gonna help you, especially when you're on the, uh, the fairways and you're hitting your shot uh, into the green. Because what you wanna think about, what you wanna do is you really wanna use the sole of your club. The sole, the sole of it. This piece, okay? You don't want to have that leading edge hitting into the ground. That goes along with not hitting down and shallowing out your swing and ball position, all that good stuff. So to use the sole, yeah, you really need to think um, shallow out that swing down here. So you're coming down like this, as opposed to hitting down on the ball. And a good way to do it, just before you hit your shots, is just hold your um, hybrid down around the neck and put the, um, the shaft up your left side here and just, Take a swing 
and then just feel that get horizontal here and swing. So this is your practice swing out on the course. Just sit here, shallow it out, rotate through. Against your side, shallow it out. So that's gonna be your feel. Okay, and that's gonna help you engage the sole of the club because that's what you want to interact with the turf, not the leading edge. Best shot I hit all day. Uh, so you're shallowing out, you're coming in here, right through there. Soul, soul on the ground. Think soul, you'll be good. Okay, uh, last tip for you. We wanna keep it as simple as possible. So I think with these keys, you'll, you'll really be able to uh, have some great success out there. This is going to be where you accelerate in the golf swing. Okay, and I want you to think your acceleration point is gonna be here, after you made contact with the ball. It won't be, but that's what I want you to think it to be, okay? So you're doing everything, you got your setup stuff with your ball position, and you're not hitting down, you're gonna use the sole, you're shallowing out, everything's good. And now you're here, I want you to really accelerate here, but the key about your acceleration point, I still want that club low to the ground, at your acceleration point, which is gonna be over here. So I don't want that to get up here, okay? We wanna accelerate, but stay as low as possible with the club head, okay? So I'm here, and I'm just thinking down through there. Here, accelerate through there. So even on my practice wing, maybe you do this sometimes, and then this time I'm feeling that, and I'm just like, and you're almost getting like I'm chasing that ball type of thought, that feeling like I'm staying down and I'm really chasing out after it. So there you go, those are my keys for how to hit your hybrids, long and straight. Pretty simple, I don't wanna get too technical, don't have too many things to think about, just a few little things that will really help you improve, get more consistency out of your hybrids on the tee box on the fairway, wherever you, wherever else you might hit them. Hope that helps. Be sure to hit that like button, subscribe to the channel. Love you guys. See you next video.